Pakistan, caught between Iran and China. It's two neighbors with the highest number of coronavirus deaths in the world. And on Wednesday, Pakistan detected its first two cases in the capital, Islamabad, and the largest city, Karachi. As panic creeps in, many people like Mumtaz Khan are rushing to buy masks. But there is not enough to go around and prices are rising. Since we came to know about coronavirus cases in Pakistan, everyone is worried and are panicking. We came here to buy N95 masks, but they're not available in the market. We are wearing normal masks instead. The supply of masks is very low and its demand has suddenly risen. Suppliers are asking for more money because of increased demand and a flurry of buying has led to acute shortages. The government has closed schools and colleges in some areas. It's also shut the land border with Iran and suspended all flights to the country. People are stuck on both sides. I came to Pakistan six days ago for three days and I'm stuck here at the border because the border is closed. I don't know what the problem is. I don't have water and food and we're in a difficult situation. The government says there is no need to panic and has launched a media campaign to spread awareness about the new virus. It's an uh, outbreak. The government is prepared to deal with any emergency situation. At least 15 people are under watch and close observation, and this includes people who have recently arrived from China and Iran. But there are concerns whether Pakistan's health facilities can cope if the virus spreads in its densely populated communities. Priyanka Gupta, Al Jazeera.